So we've given the buck, what is it, about 20, 25 minutes. We're going to go in and just kind of look to see how much blood we got. I think we hit it a little high, but I'm really confident on the shot. So let's go take a look. Oh, you want to find your air? I thought it was somewhere right here. Thought your air was somewhere right here. Well, he was standing right here. This is his tracks, I bet, right here. So he was standing right here. He was standing right here. And he shot. You see blood? Where's the blood? Uh, right there. It's kind of hard to see with the ground wet. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. 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 Let's see what kind of blood that is. Looks very, very light colored. was a high shot. See how hot they all the blood. There's blood up over here. Oh yeah, there's some bubbles in it. Oh, 
There he is. Oh, yeah. He's dead right there. That thing didn't go. How far? The deer feeder's right there. Dude, that, that deer feed is 45 yards. Uh, Prof, he's 55, 50, 60 yards. <sighs> no blood trail needed. Blood tracking. Yeah. They, the blood is getting bubbly. Look at that buck right there, Nana. Look how heavy that deer is. That's a nice timber weight. That is nice timber. What do you think? It didn't go far. <laughs> now that's the way you want to find your deer. I'm surprised we didn't even see him. Dude, that G5 Mega Meat. I mean, it tore him open. So your shot was a little high. It was long all day, though. Yeah. Dude, them G5 the Mega Meat. Get them done. That's nice. Well, I'm glad that you were here with me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't shoot one last year. So that's You one. got one last year. You got two last year. Parker didn't get anything, and I didn't get anything. But we already got it done. What is this, the fifth day in? Let's see, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Today's the third fifth day. day. It's the fifth day in of the season. So we came in the first day, Parker and I, and Preston had to work, and Parker was off school, so we were looking for either one of our bucks. This is the one I wanted. He wanted this other one. And we have it set up to where if either one of them came in, I'm left-handed, I can shoot. He's right-handed, he could shoot. And the wind just was not right for us. We knew it from the get-go, uh, the way the deer acted. So today, they had no clue we were here. Perfect, there was really no wind, but perfect scenario, great hunt. I'm glad to have my boy with me. Um, let's get this thing Heck, drug out of here and cleaned up. My deer died right up there. Oh yeah. My right deer there. died right there. So that, I mean, this is, this is a good spot. It's a good spot. He's heavy. Look at this. He's a, he's a pretty heavy deer. He's not as heavy as yours is, but he's close. Mm -hmm. He's wide. Should I take a picture for mom? Yeah. Let's get this guy out of here and get it home. You go see the spike we got? Little spike? Hi. Yellow spike? Hi. That deer slayer here. Little two point? Yeah, the tug it one. What do you think about that white tail buck deer? My goodness. Congratulations. It's no Parker deer, but it's uh, bigger than those last one shot. <laughs> Awesome. So what happened? Tell us the story. We were sitting in the blind. The deer started coming in before the feeder was going off. They started browsing around. He wasn't there, but the, the smaller version of him was there. And we were just making sure. I knew it wasn't him, but I was making sure. Are we sure? Because it still wasn't fully daylight yet. And so they're wandering around, then the feeder goes off, and then they come back and start eating and stuff, and then they're just wandering around a little bit, and then they're, they were looking back and stuff, weren't they? Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden he pops out and another buck pops out. 
little butt, that decent one, went in the woods and then came out with that one. Oh, that's true. Yeah, the de the smaller version of him went turned and went into the woods, and then he came back out with this one behind him. So that's when it was on. So we just waited till had a perfect opportunity to get the shot. Yes. <coughs> Little bit high, but it actually exited good on the other side. But that's what that mega meat broadhead does for you right there. Only went about 65 yards. You have to black and white that. <laughs> How far did it go? You said 65 yards? Yes. If that. If that. 60, 65. There's definitely a nice buck right there. So you've had your eye on him for how long? When did he show up, Bob? Has it been that long? So I guess it's been, he was in velvet and stuff too. Yeah, a month and a half, two months. Yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm.